Hello everybody, my name is Jacob, and welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Remake. Let's turn on the choo-choo machine and see if that helps us make our way... Uh... Uh... You can't be serious right now. That worked? That... Uh, uh, everybody good? But that wasn't the train. Or are trains here powered by tornadoes? Uh, I think that's... You think that's what? How, how are we hearing this? Oh, that's a speaker? Sorry, I couldn't tell from the PlayStation 2 graphic. There are moments where I just kind of brush off the way this game looks. Where I'm like, oh yeah, it was made for PS4, and like, I'm playing a, the PS5 version and all that stuff. And then there are moments where I'm like, really? Really, guys? Also, am I meant to understand what Seng is saying without the subtitles? Because I can't. Tifa. We gotta go. They're really gonna drop the plane. Yeah, they are. We gotta go now. They won't if Barrett and the others have anything to say about it. The sound mixing in this is just All we perfect. Can do now is keep moving. Yeah, keep moving. Because there's nothing that we can do Please, let's be in time. if we're stuck in a train yard. All right, please let us be on time, so let's get out of here. Oh, those flying fuckers. I really don't want to deal with them. I can't go that way. Cloud? Or... Oh, great, more. Why am I, not surprised? I have to deal with Baldy McNose hair and a bunch of other ones. Great. Alright. Big train. It's time for the big train. We're doing this again. Again. Is this... Is the train the thing that's moving, or is it a magical big tornado? Okay, this looks like the train is moving. But before, it looked like a magical big tornado was the thing that was pushing the train. Wow. Would you look at that? I don't know why you're surprised, Aerith. It's the same thing we did before. How does that... How does it have power? Kill the drakes, come on down here, you silly drakes, I wanna slash at you. Come on. Yeah, wind wall, sure, whatever. Okay, buddy. Okay, fucker. Oh my god. Oh my god! I turned the difficulty down so I didn't have to deal with harshness from you fools. Is it gone? Oh, it's back here. Okay. Quick. What's the point of casting a spell if it only hits the specific area that they're in? Screw this. Just keep hitting him with Tempest. Mm-hmm. There. Done. Beautiful. Perfect. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Gotta push both of these, I'm guessing. And then we'll be able to get across the top. Yeah. Okay, that's how it is. How clever. It's a good thing I came over here first. Thanks. 
Let's go. Escaping from the train yard. We're all escaping from the train yard. I can't sing in case you didn't notice. Gotta save my two girlfriends. We're a polycule. Everyone is bisexual. Polyamorous. Okay, you don't have anything particularly of use to me. Um... Yeah, all right. Um, actually, how much do we have? We should buy some mega potions while they sell them for cheap. All right, now let's keep going. Almost there, come on. Except for the big enemy right. that's about to appear. Why, why? I don't get the ghosts. I truly don't get their deal. Because before it seemed like we were just playing with them, and now it seems actually malicious. Is Aerith gone? What? The kids that the Black Wind carries away have to live in the train graveyard forever and ever. What the fuck? I'm so confused. Hi, you're the sad. You have an a teardrop. You're so sad. You're just trying to help, aren't you? Who are you trying to help? Because if you're trying to help us, you're doing a pretty <gasps> rough job of it. Is that a robot? You're the one who... I'm... Uh... Are you ready? No, I'm not. I don't know what's happening. Well It's like the Mass Effect 3 you boy. Uh, you got me. Hey, where's Aerith? Oh. I'm ready. They never found her? I'm ready. Oh, Aerith. You're a little lost girl. That's why they took you, because they recognized that you're lost. Ready. Just like them. I think. I don't know. This game's plot can be kind of nonsensical. I'm right here. Wait, what? Was that a chariot? The fuck is going on? Where did they come from? I thought she was like... Yeah, I saw that you found her. That's the part of the game I actually would like to maybe be elaborated on a little bit. I could have done with less train hopping and more like, how did you find her? What in the Kingdom Hearts bullshit? 
I'm, which, hey, that actually makes sense. Because, you know, Square, Kingdom Hearts. Let's go. I'm fighting this chariot thing. Eligor. What is this? Okay. Okay, can't fight the wheels. Not trying to fight the wheels. Trying to fight the horse. Yeah. Alright, can I hit it with Blizzard? Okay, Blizzard staggered it. Holy shit. Okay. Can't attack the wheels. Good to know. Okay. Get back. Alright, Cloud hit him with another Blizzard. And then Tifa, while well, we got you here, can you hit him with a Star Shower? And then Aerith is like almost... All right, Aerith's at max now. Oh, and Tifa has a summon, too. Um, Aerith, can you... Let's see. What? Oh, he was about to do a thing. Okay. He's gonna reflect something. How do we hurt it? Hit it with magic. It'll bounce right off. Gotta deal with the barrier first. Gotta deal with the barrier first. All right, can Ifrit come and help? It's a good thing that I that Cloud said that out loud because I was about to have um, Aerith launch her like beam attack at it, and that probably would not have ended well. All right, um, Blizzard. Okay, no, Blizzard just literally bounced back at me. Um. Wait until okay. It's it's barriers gone now. Um, Aerith, hit him with Ray of Judgment, and then Tifa, can you have him do Crimson Dive? That did fuck all. Holy shit, that actually did nothing. It's kind of impressive how little that did. Come here. Get down from there. Oh, this is not good. Okay, okay. Dodge. Alright. Hit. Aerith with a potion. Come here, you little shit. Okay, really quickly, I want Aerith to have him do a crimson dive one more time before he leaves. And does his mega powerful thing. That I know he's about to do. Yeah. Hellfire. Hit him with it. Come on. Um, can he no longer be staggered? I would like an explanation on that. Okay, and then I'll hit Aerith with a cure. Okay, we're doing another thing. Javelin move. Okay. 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 Oh, shit. Hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, my mic is getting... Okay. Sorry, technical difficulties on my end. I think. Okay, my mic is still getting picked up by that. And it's getting recorded. Okay, I guess we're fine. My audacity, for some reason, is not picking up my mic. Why not? Yeah, my audacity is not picking up my mic at all for some reason. But... OBS is picking up my mic, so I guess we'll just continue. Everything's fine. I still have my audio recording up for this section. I'll just have to figure out why that happened, because it didn't do that for the last episode. Okay, hit him with another blizzard. Maybe I should be focusing on the wheels. Ow. Okay, lock on. Hit him with a limit break. Let me hit the wheel with a limit break. 
Are you fucking kidding me, game? The super-powered ability like a limit break and you can't have it just folk lock onto something? That's so fucking stupid. I can't do anything to him because I can't get near him. So stupid. Okay. Um, refocus now. Okay, nobody else has their. Teeth is about to have hers, so we can have her do something. But Aerith, in the meantime. Ah, oh, fuck it. Aerith, do healing wind. You might as well. And Cloud's about to have Healing Wind again. Stay back. Just, just I have to stay back. Because I can't do anything against him, apparently. Alright, now... Tifa. Somersault. Fucking do it. All right, so I gotta wait for him to get close. Her somersault did not hit it. I love an enemy that, because it moves, um, is now immune to any to all, almost all of our basic attacks because he stays in the same place. Okay, cool. Come on, fuck him up. Um, Aerith. Uh, no, Aerith, can you do Ray of Judgment, hit him, and then Star Shower, hit him. Let's all fuck him up, come on. I busted one of his wheels, why is he still up? Come on, man. Bundle up. Okay, Tifa, what are you... Sure, fucking star shower for Tifa. If she can even hit him. Come on. He's so fucking close. Come on. Hit him with... Come on, a... One more blizzard, something. Come here, you shit. Come on! No more playing nice. Fuck it, I'll use it. There. It literally took one more attack, which apparently the limit break couldn't fucking do. And you can go to hell. I don't know what this thing is. I don't know why this thing is here. It's a ghost, I guess. Because there's actual real-life go. ghosts now. Right. Right. <laughs> what? Uh... uh what? Did we save them? It's that ghost. I'm glad we're all so concerned. We're all in such a rush. Wow. Um. So long. What? What? Sure. Sure, I guess. Oh, and look at that. A convenient hallway to go now. No trains to move. 
Is this the... Are we done? Are we out of the chapter? Or... That's Sector 7. Cloud, use your big-ass sword and let's bust through the wall. Through the very thin chain-link fence. Or Tifa bust through it, sure. Why the... What's the fade to black? Okay, fight for survival. Why? What was the point of that? What was the point? Of, we fought some ghosts. What, what was the point of that? What did that add? That was just a... Oh, thank God, Jesse's still up and alive. Yeah, I'm sure they're gonna do that, guys. As if you haven't been already? What kind of a helicopter can stand up to a minigun? Like, come on. He's obviously not the best aim, but... but he's aiming... That's just, that's just general action plot logic, though. Fuck the fascists. In the words of Porco Rosso, better a pig than a fascist. Could just be a ploy for them to attack Avalanche, but I doubt it. We still got to go though. It doesn't matter if it's a ploy or not. It looks like everyone's been evacuated though, so that's good. Maybe, hopefully. Please let us through. What? Oh. Okay, but what are these now? These are different ghosts from the other ghosts. What are you? Cloud, Tifa. I don't get it, man. We have to get past whatever it takes. I don't get it. Right. Enigmatic Spectre. Wow, this is on easy. This dude's like this on easy? Take out the surrounding ones, I guess. Okay, and that hurt the... Okay. The Enigmatic Spectre is vulnerable. Okay, I see that. So I attack the other Spectres to attack him. No, you don't. There you go. Come on. Take him out, take him out, come on. Almost got him, come on. Alright, can I use a blizzard on him? I didn't think I would have to pull out my whole arsenal just for that one guy, but I guess so. What do you mean there's too many? We just defeat? Okay. Ludo narrative dissonance. Are they going to help? Aerith? Come on. An explanation, Aerith, would be nice, maybe while we're running. Oh, by the way, those are spirits and they mean XYZ. If you know, it would be helpful. People are still here? What is everyone doing here? Do you not see them attacking the pillar? Get the hell out of Dodge! Yeah, we're hoping that they win, but if they don't... Then you won't get crushed by the plate. Holy shit, Wedge! 
Oh my god, dude! Oh my god, Wedge! You okay? Cloud, it's Shenra. They're trying to take out the pillar. I know. I have to go back. No, Maybe you don't. Still... Wedge, we're here. We got this. Stay down. Stay with Wedge. I'm going up. Um. I'm going to. I can still fight. No, you can't, Wedge. It's okay to say when you Big can't fight. They were shooting at me and he. Wedge, please. Wait, Cloud, is Biggs dead? Don't worry, I'll patch him up. There's no way in hell Tifa's not coming up. Wedge, listen to me. You stay here with them. Tifa's not coming up? I don't believe that for a second. Wow, Biggs got shot. Or at least it seems like he did. Nobody in this game actually bleeds because it's T for teen. I love we're we're hey guys we're going in to fight a bunch of mercenary to fight a bunch of like military people. Grab your best weapons, uh, which means Biggs. Grab your pistol. Okay, um, just get a bunch of high potions because Lord knows I'm probably gonna need them. Um, and grab some Phoenix Downs. Because, again, Lord knows I'll probably need them. Okay, that's plenty. Let's go. I cannot believe Tifa is not coming up here to fight along as well. I'm getting sick of this. Don't they have anything better to do? Tell me about it. See how hard we got hit over here? Shit, what's wrong with these people? I don't know, but I'm about to show you guys what's wrong with me. Oh, d you don't, you fucking dare. You guys got no idea who you're messing with. Bye, boys. Who's next? Oh, don't think I'm going to get away with this. Well, let me show you what I got. You're throwing a lot of them, huh? Let me show you what I got for that. Who wants a grenade of your very own? I bet you guys do. Come here, big boy. Now, this is satisfying. After all that ghost shit and dealing with feeling like I'm just banging my head into a wall, trying to fight them over and over, getting a bunch of mindless goons to just... Tough, but doable. Getting a bunch of go mindless goons to just, like, mow down. Now, that's that feels good. Fleeing? Fleeing from what? Oh. I did not even notice these guys were here. Okay. Come here. Come here. I want to show you the business end of my Buster Sword. Excuse me, buddy. That's kind of mean. Your guy, your friend's like laying here on the ground, and I'm trying to beat him up. So I would appreciate it if you could let me do that. Thank you. Nothing to it. So do I go this way then? This way is blocked. Or do I... Oh, I have to go that way. But I couldn't do that before because I was technically in a fight. Gotcha. Um... What the... What are you guys doing? Man, I really wish that Aerith, the person who seemed to understand what was going on, was here to explain... Hey, 
is Wedge? He's okay. Your boyfriend's Don't okay. Worry. He'll bounce back. They stare so in love. That's good to hear. You can't tell me otherwise. Could have used some extra padding myself. <laughs> Don't talk. Just kiss me. It's pretty bad up there. Yeah, that's why the big guy with the sword showed up. Cloud, promise me. Don't let it be for nothing. I won't. He's a soldier. If I tried to make it about him, he would just yell at me. You're a good man. Giving me that... that comfort. <sighs> That's a... Oh, oh I thought he was dead. <laughs> never, never mind, one more thing. It's an orphanage. Mm-hmm. In the sector of five slums. What about it? Kids, I've been there. They're great. I used to visit... <laughs> yeah, I've li I literally was there earlier today, Biggs. You have no idea. That you'll have to do yourself. Let me guess. Not a fan of kids. No, they're just not a fan of him. But you have so much in common. I thought you were dying. Were you not like dying? We have enough time for this conversation. <laughs> Your hair, it's so pretty. It resembles a girl I saw at the Honey Bee Inn earlier today. Cloud. Our future is in your hands. <laughs> oh, and one more thing. <laughs> like, I'm not trying to... I'm not trying to take away from the serious moment, but like... I, I don't know how seriously to take some of the stuff in this game. It feels like for every serious moment or thing I think should be taken seriously, the game's like, nah, not really. We're making a joke out of that. Ba -ba -ba. Who wants to get sliced up? Who killed my buddy? No, you don't. I will slice them helicopter blades right off your hand and get the hell down here. Come here, buddy. Here. It's a little chilly up here, don't you think? Gotta get to Barrett. Gotta get up top. Don't have time. To console every single person I see. Come here. I'll deal with you fools on the ground first. Going in. No holding back here. Come here. Okay. Shatter and then yeah. There. Quick, up the ladder, up the ladder. We gotta go, we gotta go. I feel like I would have preferred this game with the turn-based combat. Because it's just some of the active combat makes some of the fights... Like, I feel like the longer fights I would have been less bugged by if it was turn-based. Because at least I'm like, oh, this is what I'm expecting is a long fight that's turn-based because it's going turn by turn. As opposed to an active, a piece of active combat I'm expecting because it is active for it to be a little bit faster. Oh, this motherfucker! Uh, they're setting it up so that when they blow up the pillar, they can make it seem like it was Avalanche's doing. Which normally I would say wouldn't work because Reno is such a dumbass, but clearly it will. I know you. Yeah, and Baldy McNose Hair knows me too. <laughs> the question is, will the two of you let me get away without a fight? Oh well, that that answers that. First class. 
Cloud, quick, run directly into the gunfire. Not good. Yeah, you don't say. Hey, Cloud, maybe get... Don't stand in front of the barrier that is made of individual things that could clearly get blown away at a moment's notice. Throw down your weapon and surrender. I love that his name is Rude. I truly love that his name is Rude. We gonna do this thing or what? Screw this cheap ass play. Uh, yeah, Cloud, again, time to move. I'm glad Tifa's down here now. Never mind. I was gonna say, why isn't Tifa up there? But that's why. How is it? Much better, thanks. Tifa, you, you I know you want to get up there. Sorry. I can't stay here. I have to help them. Go. Follow your heart. Go, save the third in our polycule. Aerith. Kiss her! In the center of town, seventh heaven. <laughs> I don't know why that seemed like a moment like, Aerith, I love you. It's okay. I'll find her. Huh? Who's Marlene? Wait, no. I know who Marlene is. That really seemed like she was about to grab her and kiss her. Um, I know who Marlene is. I thought I was saying like, how does she know who Marlene is? Which is probably the explanation is probably ghosts. Is Aerith just a ghost? Come on. Is she a ghost in a human body? Wedge, wait. Wedge, wait. What? Okay, we're Aerith now. Come on, come on. How else are we supposed to get to Wall Market, sir? Oh, these motherfuckers. You have to open the gate. If you don't let these people through, back off. It's not gonna happen. Uh, Aerith might have something to say about that. I'm no good. Not to anyone up there or down here. <sighs> That's not true, Wedge. Don't give up hope yet. We could still save a lot of lives. You don't think we're going to stop them from dropping the plate, do you? I want to believe that we can still win somehow. We can. With Cloud on our side, we can. We got a but lot of tough something people. Something in my gut tells me we're due for a reckoning. Just this feeling. You know I, I mean? love the co the idea that they're having this conversation in front of the Shinra guards who are like, uh, yeah. You guys are Avalanche, right? I'm just going to shoot you right here. This is very noble, Aerith. Um, oh, I was going to say the guards are gone, but they were just perfectly positioned behind some of the other characters. I'm not sure what's going to happen next. That's such an ominous thing to say! That's such an insane thing to just say to someone! Our lives are in your hands. If you don't open up, we're all gonna die! I don't know what's gonna happen next. Glad we got through to somebody. I was ready to throw down. Get everybody out. Aerith needs to get to Wedge. seventh heaven, though. Wedge. Seventh heaven is just down this road, isn't it? Head straight and look right. You can't miss it. Uh, bye, Wedge. Don't Wedge. worry about me. All right, I'll get these people to safety. All right, I guess it's this Aerith's solo mission. I guess. Gotta go save Marlene. Gotta go get the girl. Go to sector five or 
Gotta go get the girl. You all have to get out of Sector 7. Now, please. Slow down. Do you know what's going on? What do they want with the pillar? I don't know, Marl, but right now you need to get the fuck out. Yes, they are. Yes. Everybody go like now. What good do they think that'll do? Feel free to cry about it later. Right now, we need to get everyone to safety. Wait, the watch should clear the roads first. Ah, good thinking. Up to it. Yeah, if you want to do that, then everybody move your asses. We don't have a we don't exactly have a lot of time. Avalanche, I take it. Now she is. Just a friend. Tell Tifa to lay low. We'll take care of things here. Gotcha, but I, I have a girl to find? Like, ASAP, please. So, thank you. I've got to get to seventh heaven. I know, we're, we're trying, Aerith. I swear we're trying. Oh god, look out! But we keep getting interrupted. Oh, fuck. Oh no! That's not good. Oh, shit! Aerith, get out of the way! Oh, fuck! Oh, that was good. That was... Really lucky, Aerith! No one's gonna wait help the girl? The unconscious girl in the middle of the road? No one's gonna help her? Okay, so we gotta take the long way around. Damn it. How the hell do they, expect us to escape? they don't, Are that's the way? point. Gotta get okay. Gotta find a way. Okay, I know there's a way through. It's just around this corner, Aerith. Don't you worry. Mm-hmm. This definitely won't get obstructed in some way. Very video gamey, I gotta say. Help the girl. Oh, you poor thing. I know it must hurt, but you've got to be brave now, okay? Come on, keep moving this way. Hey, hey, over here. Come on. Go, little girl. I'll take you to her. Ready? Mm -hmm. I'll take my sweet time. Because it's definitely not, I'm definitely not after another little girl who could be burning to death as we speak. Are you, are you serious right now, game? Really? No need to rush. There's just another random girl out there who could be burning to a crisp right now and I have no idea where she is. No need to rush. Is, I also very much like the the image of all of the people like seeing a girl seeing a girl holding a little girl in her arms and just like fuck this g bitch and just knocking her over of course Betty I've been looking everywhere for you Daddy. Betty's dad all right Aerith you're you got some shit to do Aerith all right Marlene 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 Okay, not that way. Please, I need to get through. This is it. Okay. Almost there. All right. No, it's not worth it. Why are you showing me that? I know that's confirmed. One more bird lost. Probably for the best. After all. Sang. Motherfucker. Are you serious, Aerith? You can take it from here. Someone's been a little too adventurous. Oh no, he recognizes her. Oh, that's not great. That's not good at all. Come on, Aerith. I'm not stopping the episode till we make it to the bar. Please be okay. Okay, not that way. Okay, crawl through the thing. Uh, missed the stairs completely. Whiffed it completely because I thought it was a cutscene. 
Marlene? Oh, good. Everything in the bar is perfectly working. All the neon is on. Marlene. Marlene! We gotta go, girl! You're Marlene, right? Who... Who are you? This is extremely sweet, and I don't know if I can handle it. A friend of Tifa's. She's fighting with your dad. She's with Cloud and the others. Daddy too? Mm-hmm. You mean Barrett? Yep, he's there too. Wait, Daddy's not coming home? That's not, not yet. That's why I came to find you. Tifa asked me to. She said take care of Marlene. <sighs> the thing is, this place isn't safe now. I'm going to take you somewhere safer, okay? It's okay. Oh, no, don't. Don't. No, don't. I'm not. Are they going to destroy the bar? Are they going to destroy our house? I can't handle a little girl crying. I can't do that. I know it's hard. Just remember, you still have your daddy. You can build a new home together, anywhere. <laughs> Shall we go? I, I can't handle a little girl crying. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Huh? What? What What does that mean, Aerith? What does that mean? I am so confused right now. You smell nice. Oh? Wild. Like, wild. Like a flower. Absolutely insane. Absolutely wild shit. Very cool flower, Marlene. We have to go, like, now. Mm hmm. It's the flower she gave Cloud. Yep. In much higher detail than it's been in any point previously in the game. We gotta go, Marlene, like, now. I hope you remember it. I really love the image of them, like, taking their sweet time to leave the bar as there's fire curling up outside the windows. Because they need to get out right now. I'll tell you what. We'll grow lots of flowers at your new house. Do you think that I can help, too? Absolutely. Of course you can. Hey, what's your favorite flower? <laughs> um... We have to help them get out. We have to help them build their new home, which we will do in the next episode. So thank you, everybody, for watching. Like the video if you like the video. Share the video if you'd like to share the video. Subscribe if you'd like to as well. That would really help me out. I have been Jacob, and you have been wonderful. Thank you guys for sticking with me through another chapter in this epic adventure of Final Fantasy VII. Uh, even as everything seems to be crumbling down around us uh, in the game, of course, we still got friends here to help us get through this adventure. And this has been Final Fantasy VII Remake. I'll catch you guys in the next episode. See you, Space Cowboys.